Um, my name is Phil Lyman, I'm a libertarian. Um, there's an arrogance and conceit by many politicians that they control the economy. They create jobs, they give you wealth. It's not true. The economy is created by you and I, the people working, people offering services to other people at prices they're willing to pay. That's how the economy grows. All the government does is take money from one group of people and give it to another. It can change the types of jobs that exist by punishing certain ones, by punishing, by punishing, punishing certain ones, and possibly rewarding certain others at their expense. The economy is controlled and it grows by the millions, billions of decisions that individuals make every year. All the best thing the government can do to help the economy is get out of the way. All government does is it stops our ability to create wealth. The biggest way it does that, the biggest obstacle is taxes. And there are so many different kinds of taxes. There are estate taxes, inheritance taxes, debt taxes, income taxes, gas taxes, social security taxes, payroll taxes. You, you pay tax every waking hour. I would support what's called the fair tax proposal, which would eliminate all of those taxes, eliminate them completely, replace them with the retail sales tax. The people who are currently poor and, and who are not paying any taxes would still not pay any taxes because they would get a rebate on the amount of money that they would be spending to get up to the poverty level and they would get it ahead of time. So they don't even need to spend it first. It's called a, a prebate. They get paid a rebate a month in advance. Replacing all these taxes and the regulations and the deductions and the special interests that would free the economy to grow, create new jobs, create new technologies we can only imagine. We need to make April 15th just another day. Get rid of all the forms. Make your children and grandchildren not have to suffer the indignity of writing down their most personal details and sending them to the federal government for them to determine how much to take. Thank you.